Hey guys, it is Ninja Mom here, and I am here with one heck of a friendship haul from Angie, Kentucky Waxy Girly. She sent me an entire box of wax, and then an, like an entire large flat rate shipping box of wax, and an entire large flat rate shipping box of non-wax extra goodies. Um, she sent me the, let's dive in. So she sent me the Twinkie, Hostess Twinkie candle. So excited. It smells so good. It smells like a really good vanilla sweetness. She sent me these, and I'm not gonna lie, I got in these. This came a few days ago, so I ain't gonna play. Um, she sent me these Hostess Cotton Candy Twinkies, and these taste so good. I got in and got one. Then, she sent me these awesome face masks. This one is Garnier Skin Active Mix It Aqua Boost. This is so cool. So the mask comes up here and the liquid comes here. And you fold it like this. I don't want to snap it. And then it mixes the solution into the mask and you put it on. And then she got me a hydrogel mask, a deep clean purifying Neutrogena one. Super awesome. I'm trying to go through this semi-fast. So it doesn't turn into two videos because there was a lot. I already took this out and have been using it. So my lips are feeling a lot better than all dry and crusty. This is a lip scrubber and exfoliator. I use it with my um, lip sugar scrub. One side exfoliates and the other side stimulates and helps your lips fill up with blood and get all pumpy and poofy. Awesome, awesome, awesome. I love it. It works so good. She also sent me some hot and cold iPads and these super cute Valentine's Day themed hearts. They're so adorable. I have been holding on to these for days trying to be good and not use everything. <laughs> okay, so these are bracelet slash hair ties. They're in the shape of hearts. There was three. Kids already got two of them. I'm only left with this one <laughs> and it's the red one. I love it. It was for Valentine's Day. She sent me a cotton candy scented bath bomb. She knows I love everything cotton candy, so that is going to be so fun. She knows that I love me some Bolero, and my favorite Bolero is anything watermelon. So she went above and beyond, and she got me the Bolero watermelon and aloe face wipes. The watermelon and aloe body oil, which says it's for body, face, and hair. And then the facial toner in the watermelon and aloe. These work really good. I love this stuff. I've always been, I love watermelon, like skincare, skincare. And those have always worked really good. I did open this and use it on the live. <laughs> um, this is the Strawberry Marshmallow Cream Peeps Lip Balm. Been loving. She sent me some Tarte Drink of H2O Hydrating Boost. This is a facial moisturizer. I love Tarte Hydration Boost. I like Tarte Skincare. I love skincare, period, but Tarte is a really, really good company, and they make some really good skincare products. She sent me some super yummy cotton candy peeps. I have plans for these little guys. We're going to do a... Um, s'mores night here and instead of using regular marshmallows we're going to use some peeps to jazz it up and have some fun um i also like to bake with these and um make ice cream and all kinds of fun stuff they have an awesome um peeps brand peepsonality um like video channel that you can learn to use peeps for all kinds of different foods and different fun things and i'm a peeps addict so it only makes sense she sent me this super awesome notebook. It's all sealed up, but it's like plastic. So it's not gonna break easy or anything. And it says wild at heart and it's got the kitty print. I love it. It's a 60 sheet. This will fit perfectly in my purse. She sent me some super cute paparazzi earrings. These ones the girls can wear. So, cause they're not like, they won't poke you. They're just little clip-ons. So. Um, me and the girls can ba battle between who's going to wear those. Then she knows I am obsessed with keys for like rings, like keys for jewelry. Um, sorry. So she knows that I've been buying up lots of jewelry that have keys on them, especially necklaces. And she bought me this one, you guys. 
I love it so much. And it comes with a cute little pair of like dangly stone earrings. And it's so, so, so pretty. Very excited about that. I will be wearing this now that I have got it on video. I'm trying to get through these because I, like, you guys have no idea. Like, she sent so much wax. And the last thing in the non wax box is she sent me a Peeps Pez dispenser in the yellow chicky peep. And it comes with vanilla cupcake, orange, and cherry Pez. So freaking awesome. So I have the whole collection. I have a blue one, a yellow one, and a pink one. So I have the whole collection now. So I'm super excited about those. I'm trying to stick this all back over in this box so that I can finally put it all away. Because <laughs> I have a lot. Okay. Now, she sent a huge box of wax, you guys. Like tons of wax so let's let's do this okay first things first she sent me two clamshells from the candle daddy one in lemon pound cake and one in show me your melons this smells really nice it's a little bit more um vanilla pound cake with just a touch of lemon, this would be something somebody that's not super big into lemon, but wants an accent of lemon, could really enjoy. Then the show me your melon. This is a really delicious watermelon scent. It's not like real watermelon. It's kind of more along the line, not watermelon Jolly Rancher. This is like a, like a watermelon airhead type watermelon, but it's really good. I did melt this, not gonna lie. This is Teeny's Bakery. This is fresh baked pastry, sweet sugary glaze, buttercream, vanilla ice cream, crushed almonds, and hints of cookie dough. I love this scent so much. It is the most amazing scent. Um, mm, it is almond cookie, sugar cookie goodness. Um, it's just very sweet and just delicious. Now I can put that in my empties. She sent me a mini melters bag and frosted winterberry zen, which is fruit collides with fresh and clean zen. I would have never ordered this myself. This is not something I'll melt all the time because it is kind of different for me. But I do really like it. It's very um, like sweet berry kind of calming. It's a very fresh kind of scent. Then she sent me uh, Empire Alchemy's Kitchen Sink Cookies, Gooey Caramel, Chocolate Vanilla Cookies, Pretzels, and Sea Salt. Oh. oh, that smells so good. You smell that sea salt and that caramel, the pretzels. You smell all of it. It smells really yummy. On warm, I bet that's going to be exceptional. Then she sent me Destination Wax Strawberry Seeds. Sweet and zesty strawberry. Wow, that is the realest strawberry I've ever smelled. That literally smells like when you go out to the garden and you pluck it off a vine. Like it has that vine, that seedy and viney greenness with it. Then she sent me this whole big bag right here. A pumpkin pecan zuni, zucchini, a blend of pumpkin pecan waffles and zucchini bread from Ava's Country Cupboard. Mmm. So it's just a really good um, pumpkin pecan waffle and zucchini bread together. I can use this by itself or I can blend with it. So I love scents like that. I like the ones that I could, that I call my universal scents that you can blend or enjoy by themselves. Small batch wax. This is almond, vanilla, custard, buttercream, sugar cookie bomb. Wow, that's a lot. And it's, this is a vendor I haven't bought from yet, but. I'm on a video. Hold on, bud. But this is really, really good. I want to try them. This is definitely very almond vanilla custard. I am the almond is it's got that cherry almondy scent. It's very yummy. Then she sent me an entire bag of Halloween Town from Super Tarts. 
This is caramel apple cinnamon rice crispy treats. I'm so excited. I love I've been doing up the caramel apple lately. Ooh, this smells really good. This does. This smells very much like a good caramel apple. And you do get a hint of the marshmallow from the Rice Krispie Treat. I don't get a heavy cinnamon in this, which is very nice. I love that. Thank you so much, Angie, for all this. You went way overboard, honey. Then we have another Ava's Country Cupboard Pumpkin Cupcake. Bath and Body Works type whipped buttercream Madagascar vanilla pumpkin spice freshly baked cupcakes. Mmm, you can smell like the pumpkin and like the pumpkin rind of this. And the pumpkin flesh. Oh my gosh. And the spices are very warming. Oh, very yummy. Oh, delicious. It's so good. That's going to be really nice in the fall. I used to be more of a like anytime melter. I've become very conventional seasonal melter but every now and then I like to dip outside of the box and like my bedroom depends on like what I'm watching and I'll throw in something like this if I'm watching like a horror movie or something like that sometimes I'll throw in the fall scents to give me kind of a fall vibe going on while I'm watching my movie the next one is salt mountain melts candy cane pretzel rod candy cane fresh baked pretzel and buttercream she sent me a bunch of this I'm freaking so excited Oh my god, that is, like, if you were to make peppermint bark without the dark chocolate and, like, made it with pretzels. I eat these pretzels at Christmas time that I make where I take white chocolate and crushed up candy cane and I dip the pretzels in that. And it, this is exactly what it smells like. So delicious. Then we have Dess's Homespun Scents Pina Colada. Big old chunky bag of that. I'm not super big into this one. Dessa's has never been a big, really good performer for me. For some reason, it has a weird wax note to it. Um, every time I've ever had it, I never got the scent throw. I just got a really weird wax note from it. But um, I'll try it. And if I'm not super big on it, Angie knows that I will send this to somebody I know uh, or think will really enjoy it. Then we have... Two little starfishes from Brittany Sweet Tarts. One is in Cloud Nine and String of Pearls, which is Fruit Loops, Marshmallow Fluff, Vanilla Flowers, and Musk. This smells like a vanilla, lightly musky Fruit Loop. It's not super strong. It's medium. Then we have Easy Peasy Lemon Squeezy. Which, I don't know what's in it. It's probably a lemon scent. Yes, it's kind of along the lines of like lemon pledge. Or like a lemon cleaner scent. Then I have this adorable little flip-flop from it, that from Britney's Sweet Tarts, which is Tangerine Gelato. Tangerine Orange Cream Sickle, Cream Sickle Lemon Zest in Vanilla. My favorite orange dreamsicle scent right now is from Scentsy because it is really, really good. This is a, a little bit more of like a tangerine zest. It's very bold in acidity is with the tangerine. And I don't get very much um, cream with this. But maybe on warm it will. And I could always add some cream to it to make it creamy. Then she sent me Sassy Girl Roma Vermont Maple Syrup Fresh Maple Syrup. Ooh. And these are in um, the adorable little cake bites that Sassy Girl makes love me some sassy girl i need to order from her before my no buy kicks in or my low buy kicks in oh that's so good this i could see myself melting on a morning like i'm gonna do breakfast here at the house with everybody like while i'm making pancakes and stuff and some good coffee i could melt this with a really good coffee blend or with some pancake blend or i would even throw this in with some pound cake oh yes okay let's get through Okay, so these are all Ava's Country Covered right here. Just going to do these because they are so beautiful and they're sitting right here. These are all Ava Country Covered. Just make that clear again. We have Pride Cakes, which is layered in cherry pie, orange cream cupcake, lemon sugar, butt cake, peeps, and cotton candy. And these things are so cool looking. 
I cannot wait for the melt tools from these. Like, these are so fun. And you do smell the different layers. Oh, it smells so good. You smell very, it's a very cherry, fruity, sweet, marshmallowy goodness. Then blueberry lemon donuts, powdered donuts, lemon zest, and juicy blueberry. You, you smell that blueberry as soon as you open this, and it is a very, very juicy blueberry. And that powdered donut, you get a hint of the lemon, but it's really like a, just a really yummy, juicy blueberry powdered donut. I love this one. This one's going to probably be amazing on warm. Then we have Saturday morning cereal. Blueberries, Fruit Loops, Crunch Berries, and Sugar Milk. She hooked it up, you guys. Angie, she, you're such a sweetheart. Angie is also known as Kentucky Waxy Girl on here. Oh my God, this is so good. So you get the Crunch Berries and the uh, Fruit Loops and Sugar Milk. I don't get the Blueberry, thank God, because I don't like Blueberry. But the Crunch Berries and Sugar Milk and stuff like that are very, very like top performance on there. Then she sent me a whole freaking cake slice in strawberry cream cheese pound cake. Fresh picked strawberry vanilla pound cake cream cheese frosting. You guys might hear knocking at the door because it'll be my UPS with my Scentsy club. You guys know I'm a Scentsy consultant, so look at this. And this smells so freaking good. Oh my god. You get that fresh picked strawberry and that vanilla, the cream cheese, all of it. Oh my God, it's so sugary and strawberry and cakey. Oh, some of these I wish you could eat. Then this one, another big cake slice, which is in cotton candy ice cream cake. I'm so excited that she sent me this. Such a sweetheart, such a sweetheart. Me and cotton candies. And I love that this one is more predominant. It's light fruity, but it's more of that vanilla, like signature cotton candy I love. And you get a really yummy, like, frosting birthday cake note. Such a good scent. And it's really pretty. I think that every time somebody does cotton candy scents, it should always be in signature cotton candy colors. Okay. Now we have a bunch of scent cups from different vendors. And then one scoop and one little mini little. Okay, so we have Copacabana. I don't remember who the vendor is, she said, for this. But Angie, can you please put in the notes who this is? Um, this is blackberry, sugar, vanilla, spice, caramel, toffee, and nuts. You get that blackberry with a little bit of the vanilla and spices and the toffee nuts. That's really good. It's very interesting, but very delicious. Then we have a Darling Nikki, from Mel which is melons, kiwi, and citrus. Mm, that melon is front runner with that kiwi. You smell the kiwi and the melon and the citrus. When they do citrus, sometimes with these, they add just enough citrus to really bump up melon and kiwi. And it really can. It can really accentuate those two so well. Then I did use a tiny sliver of this the other morning. This is from Ella Ever After Wax Co. Ella After Wax Co. This is hashtag mom life, Arabic coffee beans, and bedtime snacks. This is like a really good Starbucks <laughs> coffee with a touch of a bakery note. Then we have rainbow melts, so lushy, fizzy, pop, strong, bright, citrus, fizzy. See, I can't, I, I, this will go to somebody else. I can't do super heavy fizzy like that. Like that gave me that indicative pain right here when I smelled it to know that this is going to F me up. So this will get sent to somebody else that I know will really enjoy that scent. Heat Wave, which is lime, lemon, grapefruit, meringue, vanilla, bean, sugar cane, and Tahitian musk.
This is neat because you do get the lemon and lime, but that um, meringue and vanilla, it tones it down and makes it creamy. And you get a little bit of the musk. This is really nice. I don't know who this vendor is, but Angie will list it below. Then we have Satin Susie's Josiah's Jelly Licious Donut, Powdered Donut and Strawberry Jam, which is sweet fried dough, vanilla powdered sugar filled with strawberry jam. This smells so fucking good. This smells really good. You smell the powdered sugar in the strawberry filling more than anything. I don't really get a doughy note, but on warm, that could change. Then we have China Grove, which is harvest apple, apple cider, cinnamon, cloves, plums, peaches, vanilla, and flower blossoms. This is super yummy. This is lightly spicy apple, plum with peach. And the floral notes just bring out the fruitiness in this. This would be so good in like September, late September, as you're going out of the summer and into the fall. This will be perfect. Then we have Satin Susie's Mango Smoothie. A fruity tropical blend of mango, lemon, and soft notes of raspberry and vanilla. Mmm, that smells like a really good mango smoothie. And you do get a little bit of that raspberry. That's kind of neat. Then we have Beach Nights on Acid, which is Fruit Fly on Acid with Beach Nights Overpour. Okay. Fruit Flies on Acid and Beach Nights Overpour. Okay, so you smell that Beach Nights. And whatever a Fruit Fly on Acid is, it smells really good. It smells like some kind of a cake. It's got a very strong bakery note. I can't see the writing on here, but it does have a very good, like, bakery marshmallowy thing happening with that Beach Nights. Then we have Wooden Wicks Candle Company Almond Milk Coconut Latte. Starbucks Coffee Almond Milk Coconut Milk and a touch of pure cane sugar. Look at how it like it looks like a little cup of coffee with a little foam top. That is really strong on the coffee with a nice light coconut touch. Then we have a whole little like chunky mini loaf from Dessa's which is in Huckleberry Lane and Campfire Marshmallow. Now this one I like. This one I like. This you can smell like really good Huckleberry Jam and then you get that light little smoky marshmallow. This would be really good. I can see myself I'll be blending this one with some like buttery toast or like some cinnamon toast wax melts. I could see that happening. And then last but not least is one of my favorite masculine clean scents from L3. This is a scoopable in Riverbank Aquaman Pie Tree, which is Roaring River, Fresh Pine Trees, Ocean Waves, and Sea Breezes. This is like the sexiest man on the, on the earth scent. Oh my God, yes. This is the sexiest man ever scent. I am not kidding you. So Angie, thank you so much for everything. Oh, and she sent a bunch, I'm not even, even going to lie. She sent a bunch of little toys to my son, uh, my youngest son. She sent all kinds of fun little toys for him. She sent a stuffy peep and all kinds of stuff for me, but he's got it in his room. He's been hanging out with it. Um, she sent so many fun things for him um, to enjoy. Lots of little wall clingers and blind bags. My son's obsessed with blind bags. She sent so much. She also sent a super cute little turtle, um, like flower planter for him and, um, cause he has a pet turtle named Shelly. So anything with like real life turtles type stuff on it, he really gets into because of his pet. So thank you so much. And you sent so much stuff and it was amazing. I love you. You are my best friend. You know that we've been friends for years now and all the stuff you always send is always so sweet. And I have some stuff coming your way. Um, you already know you have a box headed your way, um, two boxes possibly heading your way, as well as um, some Amazon packages that will be showing up at your house. Love you. Please everybody like, share, comment below, and check out Kentucky Waxy Girl. She is absolutely amazing. Her channel and content is ever so lovely. Bye.